Hi everyone, I'm Yi Tong Meng. We are researchers from the Chinese, Chinese University of Hong Kong and JD.com. Today we are going to talk about our paper, Waterstone Collaborative Filtering for Atom Code Start Recommendation. Our motivation is a very simple problem and, and very important. We talk about how to recommend new items to existing users. This problem is important because, for example, on the news website, people are usually interested in the latest news, which have no interaction data at all. And also for e-commerce websites such, such as Amazon, they're going to recommend new products to users to make more profits. This is our problem definition. Given the user's preference distribution PU and the, and the distance among the items, we are going to infer a user's preference distribution on his code start items. The user preference distribution can be estimated by utilizing a user's rating on his rated items, and the distance on items can be derived from side information such as tags and texts on items. Our contributions are threefold. First, we are first to apply the Waterston distance to this problem. We found that Waterston distance is a very good fit to the co-start problem, and we proved that our model preserves the consistency of user tests. We formulate a complete, complete solution for this problem, and we incorporated the entropy regularizer and the collaborative filtering technique to further boost the performance. We also conducted extensive experiments to compare with the state of art. We used the Waterston distance to model the disparity between a user's preference on his rated items and code start items. Okay, this is a preference on rated items, and the QU is a different on is a preference distribution on code start items. Their, distri their distance is defined as a weighted sum of the item distance, and this is a weighting weighting matrix. Dij is the distance between item i and item j, and and the constraint here means the marginal distribution of W should equal to PU and QU respectively. And we take mean, yeah, the least value among all the possible values. For detail, for more details about how to use this distance in recommender systems, please also refer to another paper on ECIR this year. We assume users' distribution is consistent on warm and cold start items, and thus a user's preference on cold start items can be solved by minimizing the Waterston distance. Here, this constraint means Q should be a probabilistic distribution. We derive a theorem about this, about the Waterston filtering. It basically means Waterston filtering preserves the, the consistency of user tests on warm and cold start items. For the proof of this theorem, please refer to our paper. However, the Waterston filtering has some drawbacks. According to the definition of the Waterston distance, the non-zero, the number of non-zero values in QU is definitely less than PU, and PU is usually very small because a user usually only interact with a small portion of the items on a recommender system. But the number of cold start items should be large. Therefore, most entries in QU is zero. The problem is that we may not even have enough non-zero entries to make up a top K recommendation. To solve this problem, we incorporate an entropy regular writer to smooth QU. And this is a resulting problem called entropy regularizer Waterston filtering, EWF. And EWF can be solved in closed form according to the work of Kirtry and Perry.
Inspired by the success of collaborative filtering, we can learn the QU of all users jointly, with the assumption that all users' preference on co-start items are generated from a common latent space. So we factorize the user's preference on code start items as a product of two low-dimensional matrix. This is very like the P probabilistic matrix factorization work. Okay. Then we formulate the Watson collaborative filtering problem as follows. We minimize the distance for all users and the, the preference of a user on code start items is represented is represented by a summation of latent vectors. Here, the constraint means that each row of U lambda should be a probabilistic distribution. This problem can be solved using a block coordinate descent algorithm proposed by Jolie et al. in 2016. For experiments, we conduct the experiments on two well-known datasets. First is movie length, the second is opinions. For the item distance d, dij, here, we can derive the distance from set information. For movie length, we use tech genomes, and for opinions, we use stock to act on the user comments. Here is the experimental results. These are all proposed methods, and the uh, former ones are existing state-of-arts. We can see that all methods outperform the state-of-arts state on both datasets, and the entropy regularizer can improve the performance of water stand filtering by a large extent. And further, the collaborative filtering technique can improve EWF slightly on some on some metrics. Okay, this is our paper. Thank you very much.